Hi kids, have you ever wanted to be first but have gotten last, or wanted to be last but have gotten first? Well, in today's uh, verse, we're going to learn about someone who is first and who is also last. Um, and our verse is found in Revelation. And you can go to the table of contents and look uh, for Revelation. In my Bible, it's page 1028. Uh, your Bible may be different, so it's probably a different page number. And you can go to chapter 1, which is the first big number, and then go down to a little number 8. And since I'm far away, you can't really see this, can you? So, which is why I have the visu visual here, so you can see that and read that. So, it says... I am the Alpha and the Omega, says the Lord God, who is and who was and who is to come, the Almighty. Now, I am the Alpha and the Omega, that's talking about two letters in the Greek alphabet. It, uh, the Alpha is like our letter A, and Omega is like our letter Z, which, uh, were the, which Alpha and Omega were the first and last letter of the Greek alphabet. And so... It's saying there that God is the first and last using those two letters of the Greek alphabet. Says the Lord God, God said this so you can know it is true because God does not lie. Who is and who was and who is to come. If you have trusted in Jesus, you know that God has been with you, is with you, and will be with you. The Almighty. Almighty is just another name for God saying how strong he is. Almighty means very strong, and God is very strong. And so, um, if you have not, if you have believed in Jesus, you know that God has been with you, is with you, and will be with you, because this verse says so. And you know, since the Bible is God's word, and God does not lie, neither does the Bible. And if you have not believed in Jesus, if you trust in him by telling him that you have sinned, which sin is anything you think, say, or do that does not please God or breaks his rules. Now, uh, if, if you tell him that you know you've sinned, that you trust that Jesus has died on the cross and risen again, then you can be part of God's family after you've, uh, after you've told him these things. And you will be with part of his family from then till for till the till forever. Um, and so um, now we're gonna now we're gonna play a game um, volume control. If I have my hand up here, you're going to say the verse as loud as possible. Um, and if I have my hand down here, you're gonna say verse as quiet as possible. And if I have my hands here, you're just going to say the verse like regular. So, Revelation 1, 8. I am the Alpha and the Omega, says the Lord God, who is and who was and who is to come, the Almighty. Revelation 1, 8. Now, let's do it again. So, Revelation 1, 8. I am the Alpha and the Omega, says the Lord God, who is and who was and who is to come, the Almighty. Revelation 1, 8. Now, I'm going to pray, okay? Dear Lord, thank you that I could share this verse with the kids who are watching this. Um, please help them on their everyday lives. In Jesus' name, amen. Bye.